Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Cross. Last time we did a bunch of shit, got like three new party members. We found out that we were dead, even though we're not obviously dead. And then, now we're gonna go head up to Termina, because that's where Kid went, and she helped us, so... And there's really nowhere else to go, honestly. Alright. Whatever you say. But you can totally go up on the upper path anyways. Yes, we are. <laughs> totally lying to people. Because that's a thing you can do. And this is actually the first portion... It's the first portion of a, of a of a side quest to get another party member much later. Apparently so, yes. Sure, that seems like a sound strategy. You'll remember things when you get your body parts back. That's totally a thing that would happen. Anyways. Okay. Oh, Isle of the Damned incident. Hopefully we'll find out about that at some point. Of course we will. <laughs> Come up here and get a bellflower. That will be useful later. Um, we can go down there. We can actually go down here. Yeah, yeah. He tells you not to go down there, but you can totally go down here. Doesn't matter. Let's steal this egg. <laughs> also something we'll need later. Well, so much stuff for later. <laughs> we could have probably killed that monster, but there's no reason to. It's not a boss, so therefore we wouldn't have really gotten anything from it, other than maybe a little bit of HP. It's still freaking out. And here we are, we have Tutorial Brothers again. Hooray. <laughs> I love how the bird just fucking freaks out while we're in this cutscene. It's kind of the best thing. <laughs> I'm just watching the bird. I don't give a shit about these dumbasses. <laughs> and we get another tutorial boss fight. Hooray. Then they show you the turn elements. They haven't showed they haven't showed us this yet. They will, however. I'll explain it when the time comes. And turn black. It's just what they said. There are elements in this game that let you change the enemy's element. No, not necessarily change it, but make them more susceptible to it, a specific element. So you could definitely use it to your advantage. Like if you have mostly red element stuff. Then you could just pack a turn blue element and then wreck them. Not using the buff, the 
buffing and debuffing spells. He used strengthen and heat on himself, and then they just use low res to lower her defense. Aqua Beam. Her magic is actually pretty decent, so. Not great, but it's decent. And partial strength is really high. May I actually even have higher strength than Surge, I'm not sure. <laughs> My defense. This is clearly a this is a boss fight, but if it but if it wasn't, I definitely wouldn't show it because it's <laughs> kind of fucking dumb. Oh, here's his unique attack, Somersault. Doesn't even do that much damage. <laughs> why it's and why it's a blue element attack? I don't know. Like, he's yellow in A, why would he have a blue element attack? Anyone's guess, I guess. I mean, sometimes with the combo arts, with the combo, like, techs, they change color, but... Pretty much any time you have a unique art, you have a unique skill on a character, it's always in of their, of their element. No, why his blue? Yay, we got a level up even though we did nothing. There's like pretty much no way to lose that fight. Yay, strength. And she got strength and magic, that's nice. Poshul just got strength. So yeah, Poshul's strength is higher than Surge. Ooh, uplift. Yellow attack element. Not fun. <laughs> Fortunately, that is not even the last. Not even close to the last time you see them. Sadly, there's a lot more stuff up here in the second, the second half of the war of the, this continent or island, I guess I should say. There's the Shadow Forest. There's actually Fort Dragonia. That's the place we were at in the intro. We'll be going there a decent amount later. Here's Viper Manor they told us about. And up here is Termina. This is where we are heading. Oh, we happen to have a Bellflower. Yeah, we just beat him up a little while ago. He's totally not important later and not one of the best characters in the game. Nope, not at all. <laughs> Get the crazy awesome like freaking music here. I love this. I know I say I'm gonna say that a lot, but I love the music here. You only get you only got to hear it for a second because no kids cut see cut in, but. Yeah, yeah, we were gonna get married back in back where I was not dead. Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> that's not that's not a an innuendo at all. Nope. <laughs> uh yeah. Totally why we were here.
Yeah, it's totally impenetrable. Except for that we're totally going to be breaking into it in like the next half hour. <laughs> Yep, let's change party members. Now it's freaking out again. I don't fear how white does this. And her stats are kind of shitty, so... Lena's are better in every regard. She has the same strength and three more magic. And more, one more magic resistance. So yeah, she's just an all-around better character. I don't know why that screen freaks out. Maybe I'll test it with some different things off-screen. I'll try and fix it. Hopefully I will be able to, because that, that screen does come up a decent amount, honestly. Because there's like... 40 some characters in this game. You can't get them all right now. You can't get them all in one playthrough, and that's the reason why, uh. That's the reason why you can't get every. You can't 100% this game in one playthrough. Oh, yeah, Korcha. <laughs> yeah, he's totally gonna fucking go play with him some more. You're gonna blackmail your kids. Anyways, yeah. You need to play through this game three times in order to get everyone because, you know, we're actually coming to this point right now, there's a couple of points where you make it either a two-way split in in a little bit of the story, or a three-way split, which actually is three-way split right now, depending on which party member you choose to uh, help you break into Fort, to, uh, into Viper Manor, you can't get the other two until you play through it and back again. <laughs> Here we get, uh, yeah, level two, level two spells are here, which is nice. So yeah, uh, I already have an Electro Jolt, I'll buy another one, another Uplift. Probably spend all my money on elements, because that's really all you need. Although I could go to the freaking the blacksmith too. <laughs> hmm. One at least in it, one arrow saucer and one ice lance. One magma bomb. And a bushwhacker. That'll be good for now. I'm gonna go back to the blacksmith, because I'm not sure if I can get anything yet. But I might be able to. Actually, the blacksmith's back here. Down there is where we want to go. We'll want to go there eventually, but not right now. Hmm. Yeah, so that's a good choice. Good second choice, then. <laughs> 